experts that was uh, giving talks and you know you're every time you take an airplane out there you you're taking your life with you so you really are motivated to study and do well once i had been through the test pilot program the NASA astronaut training was actually a, a little bit easier because there was some overlap there, especially in the area of flying. But I do want to say something about the physical side. Getting through the medical exam on your uh, astronaut, it's the astronaut physical that you, the week you go for your interview, that is a very, very difficult, inter uh, I want to say, physical exam. And there's not a whole lot you can do to control it other than keeping yourself in the best health possible because they're many uh, applicants are disqualified for things they have no control over like you know their eyesight or maybe their hearing or something like something that you really can't do anything about i want to get back to the question we got from jay in oklahoma who asked what are your favorite space movies i mean once you've been into space <laughs> does anything really compare eileen well apollo 13 is is definitely my favorite movie and we uh, got a chance to meet the actors when they came in. Uh, had, it was it was actually uh, quite an educational thing for me because I learned more about the Apollo 13 mission as I was kind of following around the actors and the script. And Ron Howard did that movie, and uh, he did a really excellent job on it. So there's there's many many space movies. I recommend all of them, but you got to keep in mind that. A lot of that stuff is not really possible that happens in those movies, but they're entertaining, they're fun, and I think that the kids should watch them because they're really inspirational. Terry, favorite space movie? Um, I've got a few. I love Apollo 13. I love Interstellar because it's a father-daughter film. Um, there's a movie called Apollo 11. It was a CNN documentary, and when I saw that in a theater a few years ago, my heart was actually beating faster <laughs> than it was when I actually launched into space. I helped make a movie called A Beautiful Planet that was an IMAX movie. Um, and it's a great, it's the best way to experience a space mission um, in an IMAX format. But I've got a few. Great stuff is great. I could go on. <laughs> I just want to mention, uh, we did an interview